Welcome to another video by JustQuant.com. In this video, we will see how to work with problems involving two variables A and B, whose product is always a constant, say, K. In this expression, if A increases or decreases by X percent, then what is the percentage change in B? We can solve using a formula. When A increases by X percent, then B decreases by an amount given by X divided by 100 plus X times 100 percent. When A decreases by X percent, then B increases by an amount given by X divided by 100 minus X times 100 percent. This concept of products of two variables being constant can be applied to different problems. Take problems dealing with time, speed and distance for example. We know that time times speed is distance. Let us take an example. If speed of a car increases by 20%, what is the percentage change in time for the same distance? Since we know here that the speed and time are varying with the distance being constant, we can apply our formula. Since speed increases, time decreases by 20 divided by 100 plus 20 times 100%, or 1 by 6 times 100, which is 16.67%. Let us take another example. We know that length times breadth is area of a rectangle. Now, given that the area is constant, this is another example of A times B equals a constant K. So, if the length of a rectangle decreases by 10%, what is the percentage change in breadth for the same area? Since the length decreases and the area remains the same, the breadth simply increases by 10 divided by 100 minus 10 times 100%, which is 1 divided by 9 times 100% or 11.11%. Now, consider an example. Salary if A is 10% more than that of B. By what percentage is the salary of B less than the salary of A? Here A is expressed in terms of B. So to calculate B in terms of A we use the same formula that we used before, although the product of A and B is not constant. That is, when A is more than B by X percent, B is less than A by X divided by 100 plus X times 100 percent. And when A is less than B by X percent, B is more than A by X divided by 100 minus X times 100 percent. So in the example, since salary if A is 10% more than B, salary if B is less than A by 10 divided by 100 plus 10 times 100%. Or, 1 divided by 11 times 100%, which is 9.09%. So with this, we shall end our video here. We hope it was helpful. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to avail and update yourselves with more of our videos. Thank you.